Molly Pelzer, CEO of Midwest Dairy. Welcome to Midwest Dairy's Sustainability in Action series, where we show how we are investing your checkoff dollars to promote and share dairy's sustainability story. One of the many ways Midwest Dairy uses dairy checkoff funds to build trust and drive dairy demand is by funding relevant research that can positively impact the industry. The Midwest Dairy Foods Research Center, or MDFRC, is a collaborative effort between Midwest Dairy Farmers, six research universities, and dozens of industry partners with the mission of delivering research and education that benefits consumers and fuels a strong market for dairy in the Midwest region. In addition, Dairy Management Incorporated, or DMI, is also involved, ensuring research efforts are not duplicated across six dairy research centers nationwide. MDFRC research is used in a variety of ways including enhancing consumers' dairy experience, to advancing quality and safety measures for processors, to improving on-farm day-to-day experiences. Integral to this research are the faculty members and students conducting this research from universities involved in MDFRC, including three core, University of Minnesota, South Dakota State University, and Iowa State University, and three affiliates, Kansas State University, University of Missouri, and the University of Nebraska-Lincoln. The research these universities conduct is used throughout the nation by food service partners, retailers, processors, and more. It's one way that Midwest Dairy invests your checkoff dollars wisely in a way that positively impacts our region and the dairy industry nationwide. Hi, my name is Jayendra Amamcharla. I'm a professor at Kansas State University in the Animal Sciences and Industry Department. My primary research focus is in dairy processing and ingredient, uh, dairy ingredient functionality. I'm also uh, serving as the interim director for the Midwest Dairy Food Research Center uh, housed at uh, University of Minnesota uh, St. Paul campus. The research projects that are funded through MDFRC uh, is selected through a, 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 a very effective approach that was established a few years ago. The first step in this is to connect the researchers with the, uh, uh, with the industry and establish the research needs of the industry. The research needs of the industry is, is collected in four different focus areas. Export, consumer solutions, food safety, as well as sustainability. We collect the, pro uh, the research needs of uh, the, uh, the dairy industry in these focus areas and connect that with the, uh, with the faculty or the researchers in six universities and we ask them to come up with solutions. My name is Stephanie Clark. I'm a professor at Iowa State University, the director of the Iowa State University Creamery, and an associate director of the Midwest Dairy Foods Research Center. The research ideation process starts well before we meet in these Midwest Dairy Foods Research Center meetings, these consortia meetings. I think that's the beauty of the Midwest Dairy Foods Research Center, that we're bringing all these ideas together in one place. For instance, we have uh, farmers that are representing all the farmers in their state. They come with ideas, they come with problems. We have companies representing the various states and actually beyond the Midwest that come with their problems and their ideas. And then we have the university faculty the researchers, the scientists, who come with some of their own ideas, but they really need to come and listen and hear the problems and the opportunities that are available, areas that need work to be done. A lot of the ideation for what should be done is done on the farm. A lot of it's done in the food processing companies. But the dairy food researchers, the scientists who are at the universities, are also reading publications all the time. We need to be aware of the kind of work that's being done and we have to do preparatory research before we can decide to go down a, a path to solve a problem. There are several examples where uh, the research conducted by the MDFRC research uh, improved uh, the, the, the quality and, and safety of uh, the dairy products that are sold in the, uh, in the United States. A new dairy creamer and a new uh, coffee was launched by Taco Bell uh, recently that was developed by uh, the, uh, the MDFRC food scientists as well as the National Dairy Council food scientists. My name is Peggy Ponce and I work for AgriPure as the Director of Product Innovation for Ingredients. 
I believe that dairy uh, producers, uh, universities located here in the Midwest, and also dairy processors, we all want to maintain the competitiveness of dairy industry. And MDFRC is looking to provide that new knowledge, that new technology, in order to increase the value of dairy products. AgriPure and other dairy processors, we tend to work with very limited resources in our R&D labs. So that's where MDFRC uh, has supported us, going from uh, communication of industry trends and also with improving or creating new prototypes using our dairy ingredients or even in the training of new employees, new scientists. One more specific uh, example of the collaboration that we have had from uh, MDFRC is actually when they help us creating one food product prototype using our dairy ingredients that we were able to showcase in one international trade show. I'm Mary Timmy from Wayne, Nebraska, where I farm with my husband at Timmy Dairy. I'm a member of the Midwest Dairy Corporate Board and have been appointed as a farmer member to attend the Midwest Dairy Foods Research Center meetings. I'm a member of the research committee and attend meetings mostly because I have a strong interest in science myself and, and somewhat of a science background, but also because as a dairy farmer it's very important that the people in the universities doing the research have access to a dairy farmer to help answer their questions and that the people who run our plants and process our milk into the dairy foods we all know and love also have dairy farmers in the room when they're discussing the types of research that should be done. Why do dairy farmers support the Midwest Dairy Foods Research Center with their checkoff dollars? It's because we get the benefit from the research that is done. Throughout history, people have looked to the Dairy Council and to Midwest Dairy as having fact-based and research-based information for the things that we do. So if we support these research centers with our checkoff dollars, we're providing that assurance that the information we share with consumers and dairy farmers is fact-based, scientific, and trustworthy. The research that we do at the Midwest Dairy Foods Research Center is important for farmers and consumers. For the farmer, it ensures that the plants that farmers sell their milk to are efficient and help to make quality products for the consumer that the consumer wants to have. As far as the consumer is interested, the research will help to ensure that the foods that they purchase are high quality and that they're being produced in a sustainable way that's good for the planet, good for the people, and good for the farmers that work on the farms that produce the milk. If you would like to learn more about the Midwest Dairy Foods Research Center, please visit midwestdairy.umn.edu. At Midwest Dairy, we are honored to support the innovative spirit of MDFRC. Thank you to the universities, the partners, and the dairy farmers who are dedicated to improving the dairy industry every day. Mm -hmm.